What's up, everybody? This is the Force of Nature Spiritual Awakening. And today we will be talking about in the mind of a Gemini woman exposed. Okay, so now I actually know a lot of Geminis just in general, whether it's women or men. Okay, my mother is a Gemini. One of my older sisters is a Gemini. My great-grandmother on my father's side, Gemini. My uncle, my mother's brother, Gemini. My mother's father was a Gemini, okay? My grandfather. And I'm sure it's some more that I'm just not even mentioning right now, but I know a lot of them. So, let's just move on. When we're speaking about this woman, this woman is a very intelligent woman, okay? She is an intellectual. She has an extremely curious mind. She is always thinking, constantly thinking. Um, her mind is of a restless mind because she thinks about so many different types of things, okay? One thing about her is that she does love to conversate. She loves to communicate and she values that. Okay, anybody that's going to deal with a Gemini woman, okay, needs to really value her intellect, okay, because that's important to her. Um, and as it is going to be important to her, your intellect, okay, she's not going to want to be with somebody that's um, dumb, okay, somebody that doesn't have um, quick moves, okay, she's very witty. This woman is very witty. Okay, so now, usually Gemini women are very sexy, okay? They're very funny, they're complex, but they are also very witty, okay? So these women can make you laugh as well, okay? And that's why I'm saying she's funny. They can make you laugh, they can crack jokes on you and snap on you and all of these different kinds of things because she has a quick mind. You see what I'm saying? So she wants her mind to be valued, like I said before. Now, we already know that just in general, when we speak about Gemini, this is the sign that they consider to be two-faced or they have a reputation of being two-faced, okay? Um, that may be true, okay? Um, and like I said, I do know several different um, Geminis. My north node is in Gemini, okay? So... Just when you're thinking about it, um, these people, they may be two-faced, okay? Um, I like to say that they have two different sides to them, which everybody does, okay? But these are the same people that will say something behind your back, but they can still say that shit in your face. See? That's the difference, though. So, you're going to have to use this with a grain of salt or take this with a grain of salt because um, everybody's going to debate if these people are two-faced or not, okay? Now, one thing that these people can do, a lot of times, they are very, very persuasive. They can be manipulators. Um, they are very convincing. They can be liars, okay? So, or maybe they are exaggerating the truth. They're not telling you the whole story, okay? So, I do know several different people with this. You see what I'm saying? And just scenarios of what people can do, these women, Okay, they are very much the type of person that can deal with all people from all walks of life. Okay, they can sit in a business meeting and conduct business and communicate that way. They can talk to somebody that's in the street, homeless. They can talk to somebody that's a gangster and a thug. You see what I'm saying? So they know how to communicate. Okay, keep that in mind when you're dealing with this particular placement. Um, Gemini, women. So she is the type of woman, okay, that loves to enjoy outings with people, going out, having a good time. Um, they do like food, okay? I will say that they do like good tasting food. They do like getting out there and socializing. Now, these people can have a lot of acquaintances. I really don't want to call it like they have a whole bunch of friends, okay? But they do have... Um, a large networking circle when it comes to conversing, going back and forth, and just going out. They know how to um, adapt and adjust. Okay, perfect word. So now when it comes to this woman, okay, she is versatile, um, adjustable, and dynamic. She's soft-spoken, 
open-minded, enthusiastic, an intellectual. She loves to live life to the fullest. Creative, adventurous, loves to travel, loves to socialize, okay? Loves communication, okay? She can also be a flirt and very flirtatious. Um, she's a sexual person, charming, independent, a skilled communicator. So she can also be impulsive and also at times inconsistent. This woman loves spending time with friends, okay? Um, this is the type of chick that wants to go on girls' trips, okay? Wants to go to a convention, wants to go to the concert. If it's a church woman, she wants to go to the service. And she wants to go with people that she knows. And then they can all go out to eat and eat at a dino or some kind of restaurant. Okay, so they like to converse with people. All right. Um, they are about um, getting out there and um, meeting new people, um, finding new experiences for them. Okay, their partners are going to have to be intellectually swift, okay? And they are going to have to keep this Gemini woman, okay, occupied, okay? Because when you think about Gemini, you know, it's ruled by Mercury, and, and it's all over the place. It's over here, it's over there, okay? Um, they're thinking about this and that, and they, they're thinking about starting this, and then they started, but they're doing something else. They didn't complete that, okay? So they are the jack of all trades, okay? That's another thing. What else can I say about um, in the mind of a Gemini woman? I would say these women, they know a lot of information. Okay, they do do their research. They can be great mentors. They can be great teachers. Um, they want to know how their mind works, but they also want to know how other people's minds work. Okay, um, you can find them at times always having a lot to say they're very talkative okay um a lot of times they can make some extreme accusations okay about people okay and sometimes it might be right and sometimes you know it might not but um a lot of times i remember my great grandmother used to say some things you know like oh you gotta watch out for this one and that one uh -uh, i don't trust her and trust dad and stuff like that okay but my great grandmother also had a whole bunch of other things in her chart as well but just speaking just from the um gemini thing um i would say they want to be viewed a certain kind of way um in a certain kind of light um and they want to be viewed as someone that's smart and intelligent Okay, but these people always have some kind of comeback, okay? You know how, like, if you're in an argument with somebody, they, they always have something else to say to you, okay? But now they can also be dismissive and they don't, don't want to further the conversation with you, okay? So, I'm going to leave this on the sofa now. <laughs> and in future videos to come, I will go more into depth into In the Mind of a Gemini Woman Exposed. So this is a force of nature, spiritual awakening, love is love, peace and blessings to you all, and I will see you on the next one.